Powerful Voices for Kids is a university school partnership between the Media Education Lab and the Russell Byers Charter School in Center City, Philadelphia. The project began about three years ago uh, when I met with the founder of the school, Loretta Byers, to talk about possibilities for how children in that school could begin to take advantage of the new kinds of learning opportunities that are possible when you incorporate digital media and learning into the classroom. Who remembers what this word means? The Powerful Voices for Kids program has uh, some modular components um, that mean it can uh, adapt to different kinds of uh, learning environments. Could you actually come up because I feel like sometimes when people can see you, can look at you eye to eye, they pay more attention. You have some, some of your friends who maybe might be uh, not paying attention as well as they could. Thank you, Samson. So Shayla, could you say that again? What's an author? The author is somebody who writes movies and films and, and they write it for target audience. <gasps> Look at those words. Another component of the Powerful Voices for Kids program is um, a summer program. It's an informal play and learning experience where students from uh, Temple University here get a chance to um, play with kids, uh, exploring uh, digital media in the context of very simple production activities that even uh, young children can uh, develop. And then you can drag into the photo. Awesome. Why is it orange? Because that means it's highlighted. That's, that's the box you're using right now. Another component of the Powerful Voices for Kids program is a parent outreach initiative. And we also spend a lot of time thinking about how to document and research our process. Because really, our goal is to provide a set of um, tools and resources, lesson plans, and really new knowledge to help other educators in other communities um, make use of some of these new ideas that we're developing here in a laboratory-like setting uh, at the Media Education Lab. One of the biggest challenges we've had to address is sort of mm, acknowledging teachers' anxieties and fears and parents' concerns about the sort of overwhelming role of digital uh, media in the lives of children and really transforming some of that um, natural protective and anxious attitude uh, into what we call an empowerment perspective. Really thinking about how children and young people can be empowered by digital and media uh, as tools for learning and engagement uh, and building um, intellectual curiosity. For about the last 30 years, uh, digital and media literacy has been mostly implemented in the context of secondary education. But very little work has been done exploring how digital and media literacy can be implemented with children ages 5 to 13. So that's really the origin of the Powerful Voices for Kids pro uh, program, trying to find out how to build kids' critical thinking and communication skills when they're five, six, seven, eight, and nine years old. Yeah. 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 Yeah.